Hey everybody, how's it going? Um, I'm just sitting here chilling, smoking my cigarette, just got the phone, uh, calling up, you know, all the government people that we need to get a hold of. Um, Governor Bentley's office here in Alabama, uh, they were nice enough to uh, go ahead and update our laws, our gun laws. And uh, what's up now is um, people like me, felonies, federal felonies, we can't own guns. Well, what happens now, thanks to our new gun law, is I can carry a gun now as long as it's not loaded. As long as I don't have any ammo, I'm okay. So I'll be able to not just sit in my front yard, but I'll be able to go out to the street corner, be able to go to the you know, town square, capital, wherever, you know, and show my guns. Um, now, uh, a little bit more information about this uh, November 5th, you know, as everybody's aware of, you know, I'm all about leaving the ammo at home. And uh, I can't stress that enough, you know, it's really important because there's no need for it, you know what I'm saying? I mean, all you're going to do is be putting your own freedom at risk, you know. Uh, November 5th, let me go ahead and break it down for a second, okay? Um, it's a peaceful situation okay we are going to show that we have the freedom of assembly okay we're going to show that we have the right to bear arms all right and we're all going to assemble together we're going to bear our arms together and i like that saying uh, united as one stand against none you know for two hours from six o'clock p.m to eight o'clock p.m that we are to stand silent with our weapons drawn. You know, just pop out a chair, put on some headphones, whatever, have your AK, your M16, your bazooka, whatever, right next to you. You know, and just sit there, you know. Do it in your own front yard. Do it on the street corner of your own neighborhood. Go down to major intersections around your town. Go to the town square. Go anywhere. Capitol buildings, whatnot. Go anywhere. And don't look for others. Okay, I can't stress this enough. Okay, you gotta spread out. For every 100 people in America, we have 101.05 guns. All right, so America has more guns than it has people. All right, so if you're looking for people, they're everywhere. So don't cluster together, spread out. You know, it's not about. Yeah, you know, let's protest and march together. Let's go out individually and make our statement individually. You know, if you're an Anon, you know, you should, you know, fly your flag. You know, throw your flag up, throw out your mask somewhere, put it on if you'd like to. You know, I'm going to have mine chilling right there on my front porch. And I'm going to be chilling right here in my front yard with my guns drawn. So, that's what my plan is for my house, for me. Uh, it might change, you know, seeing how my gun laws here in my state have changed and I just might go ahead and Take off and hit the road because now we're allowed to travel the street with unloaded weapons so You know like I'm trying to tell everybody if you can do me a favor and do everybody a favor get a hold of your local gun clubs Okay, and remind them that if they're going to participate and word it this way Okay, just call them up say look just thought I'd remind y'all if you're going to participate, then please keep your ammo at home, okay? Uh, there should be more public service statements about it. There's going to be some here. Y'all can look forward to that. Uh, get your ducks in a row, okay? Remember, we're not speaking against any group, okay? That's what the whole united as one's about. You know, if you claim that you're united as one, and you stand there, and you start preaching against somebody, well, look at that. You're preaching against someone, and that makes it not united as one. Alright? So please keep that in mind at all times. That we're not making a statement to the system in any worded fashion. Okay? We're simply going out and showing the planet that we're here. And that we know what the hell's going on. And that we are united as one. And divided by zero. Through and through.
that's just not an anon thing y'all I mean it really isn't I mean I love that anon has the hell out of it but honestly we all need to unite as one you know we don't need to let the new world order think they can just walk on us now they're trying to cite race riots and they're trying to cite civil war and they're trying to cite all kinds of shit to happen you know they're trying to get everybody angry and everybody pissed off you know and they want everybody to have a problem and they want everybody to create chaos and I want everybody to show that we will not be in chaos okay as a lot of y'all know whenever y'all's power goes out for a week at a time what happens everybody comes outside and your communities gather stronger okay see we already know that the people stand and we need to share it with the people and let the people know that we all stand together all right it's gonna send out a statement to the people in America it's gonna let the ones that believe that all is lost it's gonna have them drive down the road and see everybody with their guns out and they're like damn we're in there aren't we hell yeah America right land of the free you know right to bear arms freedom of assembly freedom of speech you know so November 5th is a day that we show that we have those rights and we just abide by them okay let's not riot let's not blame it on the other group you know Republicans and Democrats and independents because you know me personally I think the Republicans and Democrats is a joke you know, I mean, I'm not saying, haha, joking, look at the Democrats, ah, oh, look at it. No, I'm saying that it's bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Y'all are voting for the same damn group no matter what you do. It's that whole, you know, where, where do you want me to kick you, in your nuts or in your shin? You know, either way it goes, you know, your, your options suck, you know, I'd rather you not fucking kick me, you know? And I think that us sitting out here with our guns drawn will show them that, you know, we know our rights. And we're going to abide by our rights. Um, plus, uh, any of y'all looking to donate? You know, we got some pretty damn cool things to donate to. Uh, the billboards are over. Okay, we don't need any more uh, direct funding for the billboards. Uh, that duck is, is in a row. You know what I'm saying? That, that shit's flying. Um, TV commercials. You know, we are still looking for people that... Write commercials, you know, that are involved in that. You know, we want them to hit us up. You know, we got some cool subliminals for y'all. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up, you know, eight minute and five seconds so far. I have a hell of a time getting my shit uploaded. So we're going to go ahead and call this one Gravy. And y'all have a good one. Thanks again.